Okay, so today I'm going to be talking about how to hook up dual monitors to a Mac Mini. Now, there's the newer kind, um, like this, and then of course there's the older kind, which you'll recognize, uh, like this. Now, uh, it's possible to do on both kinds, uh, and there's two different, at least two different ways to handle this, and I'm going to talk about both methods. The first and best solution for dual monitors is to get a modern Mac Mini. They have two video ports, one is HDMI and the other is a display port. Of course, both can be adapted to DVI, allowing you to use two DVI monitors. Even though Apple sells the adapters, um, you'll save yourself a lot of headache um, if you just go out and get yourself something like this. And these are a bit hard to find, uh, but you can get them on eBay and uh, they basically have a DVI on one port uh, on one side and an HDMI on the other side. And uh, these can be used in two different ways. One would be like this, to connect the HDMI port on the back of a modern Mac Mini to a DVI based monitor. But it can also be used the other way around, to connect a Mac Mini with a DVI port on the back to a monitor or television that requires an HDMI connection. Okay, so the second method is, if you don't have two video ports on your Mac Mini, then you need to make one. The easiest way to make a new port is with one of these USB video adapters. You can even use more than one if needed. It's not really a, an adapter, so to speak. This little box actually contains a video graphics chip, and it operates off the USB bus. Now, these little guys are, I won't say they're a perfect solution. Uh, they will run a secondary monitor, um, but they're a little bit slow. Uh, they're, they're great if all you want to throw on your second monitor is, you know, email or an Excel spreadsheet or something like that work great. If you want to play games or have a lot of motion video or something, probably not going to be the best solution because uh, the frame rate will be a little clunky. So um, anytime I've used one of these, uh, I usually keep uh, all the, uh, the the important stuff on my main display and just, you know, put the extra stuff over on the secondary display. Uh, the other thing I will mention is that uh, not all of these are Mac compatible. Uh, in fact, a lot of them are not. It seems the only the more high-end models that typically run 80, 90, 100 dollars or more uh, have drivers uh, for Mac. So that's another thing to be aware of. A lot of them are Windows only. Now, if you're running Windows on your Mac, uh, which uh, as you know any of them with the Intel processor can do that, then uh, obviously you can use one of these just fine no matter what uh, type it is. Here's a single Mac Mini operating two Dell UltraShock monitors. As you can see, it works perfectly.